Good morning. Welcome to another exciting episode of the Balding White Guy Caucus. They're playing oh, our song. Oh, the angelic, the angelic sound is playing. That means we either have to rush into the house to get started, or they're calling for a vote, and we need to rush in to vote. But in this case, they're just calling for. Everybody. I start salivating when I hear that music. It's like Pavlov's <laughs> dogs. And I'm so glad I don't ever have to abide by that. <laughs> so we need we, to introduce our special guest, yeah. former state representative Kurt Oda. And I, I actually refer to him as Master Oda. Always have, always will. Because he's really good at mind tricks. Is that what it is? Yeah. I thought, I thought it was a Miyagi impersonation. <laughs> yeah, we thought that was, that was rather interesting, wasn't it? It's like, hmm, <laughs> if we envision Representative Oda, what can we have him do? <laughs> Karate. Kurt is still the gun guy in Utah. Yeah, but that's why I just carry it because you know I don't want people getting that close to me with martial arts. <laughs> this is yeah, Mister Mister yeah. Second Amendment right here. That's right. In our presence. So, Kurt, tell us what you've been up to this session. I'm trying to make a living. Yeah. I'm trying yes. to get back to making a living. Are you actually starts. getting some yeah. sleep this uh, session? Yes, and I don't miss the early mornings. I don't miss the late nights. However, I may show up for the final night just to watch and laugh. It's a good time. Yeah. The after party. So many of you probably don't know that after the midnight hour, which is when we wrap up on a Thursday night, uh, we do have an after party where we show videos and play we music and make fun of ourselves. Yeah, yeah. And we subject other. ourselves to all kinds of goofiness. Uh, and that lasts usually what an hour or so. An hour, or probably an hour, and then some of us get off to breakfast or you know head home. But that's that's the last night wrap up, just so everybody knows. And then we go home and we sleep for three days. <laughs> no, but, well, if it's on election year, you have to go and file the next Yeah, that's true. Yeah. 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 You have to go to the next. Go to the county office. Yeah. So, Kurt, what have you been doing down here? I've seen you quite a bit down here, and I know you're not picking well, up insurance policies. So, what 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 is it? I wish I've been trying to get you guys to write write your insurance with me, but you know what? Uh, I'll, I'll come down and help you with some of your bills. Okay. okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you have worked on one of my. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good bill. Thank you. Thank you. Know. Well, he's running it, so I only have good bills. Yeah. 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 It's great. Brilliant bill. It's yeah. guy. They're always great. Yeah. Tim's got good bills too. Does he? Yeah. he I've does. forgotten what they are, so I really can't say at this point. <laughs> well, I have. I need to look them up again. We lose track. That's why I keep. Uh, that's why I keep a sheet with with my bills on it. <clears throat> so when people ask me what I'm running, I can actually. Say well, this is what because I wouldn't remember otherwise. It's hard to remember, huh? It is hard, especially when you've got. How many, how well, you like that? You, you know, you just. Yeah. No, I don't have that many. I have like eight. 18. Some of these are Senate bills. So, Kurt, <clears throat> how long in the House? You said, how many years you served? Twelve years. Twelve years. And what the other thing you'll notice in the House is, generally speaking, if you're a freshman, you sit towards the front, and then as you get more senior, you move towards the back. So, you're one of our classic back benchers. <laughs> yeah. I think, that, just, I think that's just to the. You don't have to keep looking at us. I, I thought it was so he could offer cover fire. That too. <clears throat> that too. That I don't like, the, like last year, the final night. Remember that uh, crazy guy? Yeah, I do. That, uh, probably eight or nine of us that, that uh, had a clear shot. So, can tell us about the. I, I hear you have a special relationship with the Jazz Bear. Can you tell us about your relationship with the Jazz Bear? <clears throat> well, do you mean a couple weeks ago it wasn't very telling? Well, yeah, let's tell, tell our viewing you audience, the, the millions that are watching. You want the whole story? Mm -hmm. Yeah, go back a few years. I know it started. The Reader's Digest, digest right? No, this, this was back in 2005. Well, the two Reader's Digest version, you're not going to get a whole lot of information. But let's put it this way. Reading Reader's Digest, he was darting your right down on my wall. Uh, we're setting off confetti cans. <laughs> you almost mounted the Jazz Bear's head on your right. wall, is that what you mean? Or, or, or the whole skin. Oh. The whole suit. Jazz Bear <laughs> bursts into the chambers with like a confetti cannon. Sounded like a shotgun blast. Sounds like a shotgun blast. Yeah. Representative Paul Ray and I went to the floor. We had our hands on our weapons. Everybody else was standing up uh, uh, saying, what's going on? We're telling everybody, get down, get down. And uh, it, the confetti look, the launch from the confetti flew about 90 feet across the, the chamber. Uh, and, and the confetti actually looked like a glass from the spectator rooms because we were in the temporary quarters of the hospital. Oh, yeah. And, and uh, uh, then we recognized that it really was, but 
we get we went outside afterward and I said the uh, sergeant of arms said what just happened here and he said the jazz bear I said okay did you know he was coming no I said I, did you know he was coming no well how did he get in did he push his way in I said he uh, could the real guy have been tied up on the bed and they're all Oh, right. <laughs> so that's a pro tip. If you want to come to the house floor, don't burst your way in and don't. make a very loud noise. Right, that's right. Because yeah, it's not just two people anymore. Yeah. There's about 15 on the house floor. There's a lot of guns. Now, I don't I don't personally carry a gun. I just try to sit close to people like represented Oda or Representative Foss. Because I figured they got me covered. Got you covered. Yeah, but got you, you got to be kind of careful about that, too, because you don't want to end up to be the shield. One of us. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> there is that. <laughs> so, got you covered seems like a pretty good motto for you. Yeah. Got you covered. Yeah. Got your six. Yeah. You're <laughs> All right, Kurt. Hey, well, thanks for uh, thanks for stepping in. We just grabbed you, saw yeah. you in the back here, and thought we'd, we'd have you on camera. Appreciate you taking some time, yeah. and it was great to serve with you. Oh, it's been fun. You guys have been awesome, good friends. Thanks, Kurt. And, and wish you all success the rest you. of the session. Thanks. What, three more days? Yeah, almost there. Today, tomorrow, Thursday, right? That's right. Yeah. Almost done. I may slip by on Thursday night, maybe, for the, all right. for the fun time. That'll be fun. Maybe. Awesome. Thanks if again. I can find a parking space. That's the thing I really miss the most, <laughs> is my parking space. So, all right. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Kurt.